He's got to learn to harness his power within a very short time frame. I think he has a lot of help on his side, though. The green hat guy seems to know what the fuck is up. Yeah, he seems to know what he's doing. He doesn't seem to be sweating anything. But then again, he was also like, oh, you know, I mean, kind of lazy about die. everything. Yeah, like, we could all die. He seemed like to just chill in his little place and just like stay yes. out of it until he was like, now's my time. I think he may very well be a green. That guy. Oh, yeah. Maybe so. Do you think he has anything to do with the Soul Society? I think he was probably an outcast or yeah. something. Um, so the vibe I'm getting. What about Rukia? She's very, Rukia she's Chuch pretty Chuch fuck Chuch at this point. Coochie Co? <laughs> I don't remember. And I was like, so, like, you just started saying coochie. Coochie. And I was like, okay. <laughs> I don't really necessarily remember it that way, but whatever. But yeah, I want to see what happens next. We were kind of like at a uh, cliffhanger yes. type spot. So let's see what this training looks like. Y'all ready? Let's go. The strangest thing of all is that she isn't here anymore. Not a single one of my classmates even remembers. Oh. Rukia never existed. Crap. One person I thought might remember Rukia decided to cut the last day of school. Ichigo! See if you can hit the watermelon! Ooh. Nice try! But that was my melon! Think about Number one, beach boys. Out for summer. And I am flying to Hawaii tomorrow. God, what could possibly be better than going on vacation with me? Just you and ten girls? <laughs> How did you forget to invite me? How dare you leave me on this week? Damn. Feels he weird. got left out. Everyone's acting normal. Where is Rukia? Huh? Why has everyone forgotten about her? Like she never even existed. Damn. I need you to explain what's happening around here. I forgot about her so little Power Ranger powers and all that shit. Mm -hmm. I imagine Rukia is happy on the other side as well. She mm. probably has friends and family waiting for her. <laughs> she does technically have family. I have to go and bring her back. But. But. Huh? He knows too. Yep. And then the other guy from class. Hat guy's cat. Yeah, but what was all that in the back? They need to train too, probably. Yeah. Okay. Good morning, Lieutenant Hey there, big butterfly. Come here and check out these antennae. I'm a Pisces with double D buttercups. Double D buttercups. You still can't handle hell, butterflies? Now you have the rank and the pompous attitude and the weird eyebrows to go with it. How dare you mock me? I could kill you for an insult like that! A man like Kuchki would never stand by and do nothing while his own sister faces a death sentence. He'd rather kill me himself. Huh? Who would have guessed that all this time there was a huge subterranean training ground under my store? Huh. Oh, forget the act. Wow. Obviously, you knew this place was down here, but I will admit it's impressive. Before we can proceed, we must first restore the spiritual power you have lost. All right already, just tell me what to do! So impatient. All right, let's bring out your opponent and then we can start. Warrior, are you ready for battle? You expect me to punch a little girl? It's always dangerous to underestimate your opponent, Ichigo. <laughs> this whole thing's ridiculous. I'm not <laughs> fighting her. She's gonna beat the shit out of you. <laughs> pop, pop. Now yell as loud as you can. Amazing headband of justice in place. Amazing armor of justice. Protect me now. Go on, say it. The it's just the headband. What? Ah, that's just stupid! Ah! I can't believe he actually said it. Look out behind you. Oh, shit. Mm -hmm. Her and her brother probably have to fight all the time. Mm -hmm. Ururu here has the fighting skills to counter even full-fledged soul reapers. A mere human would never have a chance of defeating her outright. Spirit energy increases a lot faster when the soul is in danger of being destroyed. We just needed to find out if you'd be able to raise yours fast enough to dodge that fatal punch. And if I hadn't succeeded? Then you would have died. Why the hell didn't you say so in the first place? Lessons? You'll need them if you want to learn more. I suppose I do. But this also The cat just started strange. talking to Plus, him? it's a little weird dealing yeah. with a talking cat. You think so? <laughs> so the that, cat's going to try and Maybe Launch needs to train us. Well, I'm going to he go. He does. Are you really? This will be the perfect place for me to train in complete solitude. There he is. Ah. Uh. Hi, Udiu. What you doing? 
I'm Yoruichi. <laughs> a talking cat! No way! What? You've never seen a talking cat before? Honestly, don't be such a wimp. You are making kind of a fuss, Udiu. What's the big deal? What Ichigo does has nothing to do with me. Uh, but what about Rukia? Her life is in danger. You're forgetting that I'm a Quincy, and the whole reason I'm out here training is that I'm angry I lost to a soul reaper. Rukia doesn't mean anything to me, but this training is too important. I can't let anyone see what I'm about to do. Please watch over me, Sensei. What? Your chain will begin the encroachment where it was severed. When the end reaches your chest, you will become a hollow, and that will be the end of you. What? You even needed to ask. Go! <laughs> Bakuo, 99 Part 1 Restrict. Start climbing back up the shaft, Ichigo! How? That's all there is to this lesson. Wow. You have a period of 72 hours at the bottom of Shattered Shaft, Ichigo. If you have not returned to the top of the shaft as a Soul Reaper, then we will have no choice, Ichigo, but to kill you. Well, that was pretty fucking wild. Yeah. I know that training would be hard, but, uh... Hey, you're just gonna die. Yeah, We're gonna have like to kill you. Dire situation after dire situation. <laughs> Holy shit. So he is no longer able to be his normal self. No. And it just happened like that. Yeah. And all of a sudden, the cat's talking to everybody like well, that. Well, the cat was talking to Green Hat Guy. Yeah, but like. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'm kind of confused. Like, why would the cat either take them to training or train them? Unless he's taking them to the green hat guy, like, why why isn't he there with, like, why isn't Chad and Odahime with I'm Ichigo? sure we will find out. Yeah. And, I, I can never remember his name, the Quincy dude. Mm-hmm. What the fuck is up with that? I, I can only imagine that he has some kind of yeah, he's way like to access like all the dead Quincy's or something and mm. they can train him or something. Yeah. Because that shit looked wild. I thought it was interesting that the other people like Chad and Odahime just like started walking off and immediately he opens the box. Oh yeah. It's like I know. they would be right over there. No one can know. Also, two seconds later. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I thought the same thing. Very interesting stuff going on. Again, just kind of like an introduction to the situation. And um, there will be more. Like, I feel like if I was watching this and it was brand new, I mean, it's brand new to me, but if it was like brand new and I didn't mm -hmm. know anything about it, I would always kind of feel like, well, well what's going to happen? Like, I don't know if it's going to really like lead up to anything, mm -hmm. but through all of your comments, like everybody says like, oh, I can't wait till you get to this one part or this mm -hmm. one story arc or whatever. Yeah. So like, I know that it's worth it. It's going to get crazy. Yeah, it's going to get wild. So, uh, yeah. Super exciting. I'm looking forward to seeing what happens. Does he get out of the For hollow? sure. Does For he, sure. Does he start tra changing into a hollow and then make it? Probably. That would be crazy. But, uh, yeah, seems like a fucked up scenario. And I'm interested in seeing what happens Me next. Too. Hopefully you are too. And you enjoyed watching this episode with us. If you're watching this on YouTube, we appreciate you checking this out. And yeah. if you could give us a like, subscribe to the channel, and keep watching this show with us. Yeah, and if you're interested in watching our full reactions, we do have a Patreon. And that'll be linked in the description. We also go live every Monday and Thursday evening at 6.30 Eastern okay. Standard Time. And we even do live streaming reactions exclusively mm -hmm. on Twitch. If you're interested in that you should follow us on twitch yeah. and you will see a notification when we go live and you can come hang out with us we usually do it on thursdays but we're working around with the idea of doing it on a different day so we don't have to stream twice in one day so just follow us and you'll know when it's happening you'll get the notification we would love to see you there we really appreciate you and we'll see you in the next see one you guys.